Hi, I'm G. Craig Lewis of EX Ministries, and I am so excited about this recording that is coming up this weekend at Trinity Church, uh, October the 26th. Um, I'm doing Era of Man 5, Delusions of the Beast. I'll just be dealing with uh, the beast, the end times, um, just a uh, book of revelations and different things that are unfolding uh, right before our eyes. But I'm really also going to be tracing things all the way back to the origin of things to really show uh, how these things got in place, the things that uh, we are uh, experiencing now in these end times. So it's a very important message. I, I believe it'll be a blessing for uh, your family and you um, and just you going forward in this time with this knowledge. I believe it's just very important. Um, so we'll be doing it there at Trinity, uh, October the 26th at 6 p.m. Doors open at 5 p.m. at 12 31 East Pleasant Run in Cedar Hill. But also, I wanted to uh, request your prayers. I wanted, you know, usually we'll do a prayer on Facebook and different things and people would respond. And many times people would respond with prayers and some of them would be powerful prayers and different things. Those that support the ministry and those that can't be there would give us, um, would pray for us. And I want you to continue to do that. Uh, I want to do it a little different this time. Um, there's six days before this recording, and I would like to request six things, uh, one on each day starting today, um, if that, uh, that could be prayed for, that you would pray for if you can. Um, and you can pray in the comment section and different things um, as well, or type up you know, a short prayer in the uh, comment sections if you desire. Um, but I want you to take some time during your day, your morning, your evening, whenever you have time, and just think about this recording and say a prayer for us. Day one, which is today, Sunday, um, I'd like for you to pray against distractions. That's any distraction that could come up while we're trying to record or anything that happens uh, during that uh, session. If you could pray against that. Day two, which will be tomorrow, Monday, Pray against any attacks of the enemy, and that's attacks on me, on people that are working with me, working uh, to make this thing happen, the church, the facility, all of these different things. Uh, just pray against attacks of the enemy. Day three, we're going to pray against all hindrances, and that is anything, anybody that is being used to slow it down, to uh, hinder it in any kind of way, what we're trying to do here, because it's going to bless so many people. So we want you to pray against hindrances day three and really drive that one in. Day four, we're going to pray for receptive minds, people that are heavily into social media, people that are heavily into, you know, a lot of the junk that is being promote it. A lot of times their minds are closed because of it. Uh, they're recept or they're receptive to the wrong thing. So if we could pray for receptive minds for what uh, the content will be and what we are speaking um, to the people on that evening. And then day five, we're going to pray for relevant information. You know, not no 30 second video or reel or whatever, but real relevant information uh, that is understandable, but also that is impactful. So we're going to pray for that relevant information being revealed during this recording process. And finally, day six, which would be Friday, the day before, we're going to pray for lives to be changed. We want to see people saved, set free, delivered. We want to see people helped. There are so many people that come and tell me, man, your video, I saw it when I was 20. I saw it when I was 10. I saw it when I was 15, whatever age. I saw it 10 years ago, 20 years ago. And man, it had an impact. People are still saved. The fruit still remains. And that is so encouraging to me that lets me know that I made the right decision in my life to follow what God told me to do because people they're not just getting changed or uh, that night it's not a one night thing but they are really going the distance the fruit is remaining and that blesses me more than anything so we want to see that happen again at this recording we want prayer for lives 
to be changed. Very important prayer. So if you can pray into these things for our ministry, EX Ministries, um, the Adamant Believers Council, we'll be doing a day two uh, that Sunday morning at ABC. I'll be doing like a special feature concerning this video, but it's just going to be a blessing. People are coming from all over. People are coming from overseas and different places to be there. It'll, it's just going to be a blessing. Remember, it's free admission. Uh, just get there early enough to get a good seat, and we'll see you there. But make sure you pray these prayers. God bless you, and thank you. Thank <laughs> you.